Okay, basically this is a test between the iPhone 7 4K and the SJ9000 uh, somehow 2K2560 times 1440 at 30 frames per second. Both of them are 30 frames per second. So you, this is not a test on stability, but this is a test on the video quality. The video quality of the iPhone 7 is uh, top notch. So let me do a roundabout using two gimbal. This is not about stability test, so there will be some stability issue uh, because one is using a normal monopod, the other one is using a three axis stabilizer gimbal. So if you can see the quality of both, to see which one is nice. Okay, so basically this is a good test. Give a good roundabout this area and see which one is nicer. One with gimbal, one uh, with the monopod. Uh, the time now is about 2 p.m. So it's about the same time as the last footage. Here got a little bit of shade. Okay, one good thing about the SJ9000R uh, is the lightweightness. You feel less weight than normal than the iPhone 7. Definitely. The iPhone 7 is uh, definitely heavier and uh, less portable. But for the SJ9000, it's more portable uh, in a sense uh, because it's a very small and lightweight compared to the iPhone 7. Okay, so coming to one round. At 30 frames, do a roundabout using two gimbal. This is not about stability test, so there will be some stability issue. Uh, because one is using a normal monopod, the other one is using a three axis stabilizer gimbal. So if you can see the quality of both to see which one is nice okay so basically this is a good test give a good round about this area and see which one is nicer one with gimbal one uh, with the monopod uh, the time now is about 2 p.m. So it's about the same time as the last footage. Here got a little bit of shade. Uh, okay, one good thing about the SJ9000R uh, is the lightweightness. You feel less weight than normal than the iPhone 7. Definitely. The iPhone 7 is uh, definitely heavier and uh, less portable. But for the SJ9000 is more portable uh, in a sense uh, because it's a very small and lightweight compared to the iPhone 7. Okay, let's go. So, with the stabilizer gimbal, it will be more stable compared using just a monopod. Okay, I'm going for one round to test the stabilization and the quality compared to the iPhone 7. Obviously, it's not a fair comparison because iPhone 7 it is a very very expensive gadget with a very high quality lens. But now to see if this SJ9000R with a 3 axis stabilizer gimbal is it as quality as, a, as the iPhone 7.
na 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 Okay, going for a little bit of more speed and entrance.